fucking heaps of fucking piss, you know. <laughs> Eating as much as I fucking can. Somebody says, oh, you knew Tim, did you? Yeah, we used to go to school together. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck him. No, what I was going to say... I was going to say, these stupid fucking new words. Now, I've only just learned these new words, right? You look like a smart ass, right? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I did it. I made that bit up on the end, right? <laughs> okay, who's heard of a codegrin? You wear it. A codegrin. What is it? No, it's not, see? It's a coat and a cardigan together. Has anybody heard of that? No. <laughs> well, it's true. <laughs> mentioned the bi, what is it, non-binary. It's a fucking non-binary. <laughs> what the fuck is that shit? <laughs> oh, yeah. Sorry? <laughs> hang on, hang on. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> fucking smart ass fucking heckles me and then he doesn't even fucking know what he is. <laughs> Non-binary, right? Non-binary means that you don't tell your kids what they are, whether they're a girl or a boy. Is that right? Yes. Yeah. Yep. Fucking KFC, please. <laughs> so, have you heard it or not? Yes. You're looking at me as if you're stunned fucking mother. You're all tourists? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Are you? Where are you from? Perth. 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 W-E. <laughs> oh, yeah, wait, Perth, Perth. We used to call it Perth. There's a place called Katani, right? We used to call it Cunt Honey. Where about Perth? Oh, you want a fucking easier question, right? <laughs> right? So these non pine pine or whatever they fucking are, if they've got a penis and a vagina, I reckon it should call them vaginas. Vaginas! <laughs> Yeah, it's a WA joke. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so if it goes on and on and on, you're not allowed to have boys and girls and all this fucking shit. So when my great great grandchildren, they could marry a robot, couldn't they? Well, that's going to happen. They're going to fucking marry a robot. And then I go, You're marrying a fucking robot? And they go, Don't be racist. <laughs> um, us old people get pretty excited, as I said, you know. And then when I finish going to the party and I've got a full cup full of piss, I go to uh, go to Mount Sheridan uh, Shopping Centre. I get find the best park right outside the door, right, and I just sit there with the radio on, the air conditioning going. Every now and then I'll just put my foot on the on the brake, you know, and I'll knock it into gear so. That, so the lights on the back, the reversing lights go. Every <laughs> fucking. Oh, I spat there. I kind of drink it after I spat, you get the fucking. You get the fucking corona. Fuck that shit, wine. <laughs> oh, I got a bit of a budget on the whole holiday, are we? <laughs> okay. The Espinard. Who's been down the Espinard? Right? See us ratepayers spent fucking millions of dollars doing the Espinard up. Right? Does it look all right? All the fancy lights and that? Yeah. Sorry? You know what happened? You know what fucking happened? I'll tell you what fucking happened. Right? I was down there last night and there was a prick drowning in the fucking pool. Right? So I dragged him, right, right to the edge. Can you move your feet? He's knocking his head. <laughs> <laughs> so I started pumping the brick, you know, pumping the... There's fucking... There's water. I think I better fucking drink yours. 
Så er man fremme det, men det er hurtigt, kan man lære, hurtigt, kan man lære, man fremme det, fucking har man lært det, 40 minutter. En American come up, American tourist. And I go, I uh, said, g'day. I said, g'day, hang on. He said, uh, listen, I'm a hydraulic pump expert. And if you don't get his ass out of the water, you're going to empty the pool. And that's what happened. <laughs> <laughs> so when I was a young boy, and I left school, and I went, uh, of course, there won't be any Victorians here, will there? Because we'll have to fucking shoot you. <laughs> Is it, is it really? Where are you from, no? Where are you from? Oh, yeah, you would have just jumped the fucking river, wouldn't you? Yeah. I'm from Shepparton. I said that said last week, I said, I'm from Shepparton. Some woman yelled, that's a shit hole. How did she know? <laughs> But anyway, I was working for Dad on the farm, we had a farm. And anyway, we couldn't get on, we couldn't fucking get on, and I told him, stick it up his ass, fuck this. Right? So I go into the Shep showgrounds and there was a farrier. You know what a farrier is? You know what a farrier is? Yeah, I don't fucking tell anybody. <laughs> People do your fucking self. Right? So I said to the bike, I want a I want a bloody uh, I want a job as a farrier. It's putting the Irons on their feet, you know? And he said, Have you dealt with horses? I said, Yeah, we had horses on the farm, right? And he said, Have you ever shoot a horse? I said, No, but I told the donkey to fuck off. <laughs> 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 so hey? Okay, one more. And this is true. All those other fucking comedians tell you shit, right? <laughs> Stuff I tell you is fucking true, right? And not last year, there was no show last year, right? Because of the COVID, right? The year before, which would have been two, two there, would have been a couple of years ago, right? <laughs> <laughs> and anyway, the guy that's got the little lambs and the goats and the fucking ducks and the fucking everything, he's loading his truck up, right? And he fucked me dead if he didn't have a donkey. Right? He couldn't fit the fucking donkey in the truck to go back to Townsville, right? And he said to me, I, I was looking at the donkey, he thought it was a nice donkey. And uh, he said, Do you want to buy the fucking donkey? I said, How much? He said, 200. I said, I'll give you 150 for it. So, right. so I took the donkey home. And I thought, Fuck, I've got the donkey at home, 800 square metres. <laughs> right? So what am I going to do with this fucking donkey? I thought, oh, fucking raffle the fucker then. Right? Five bucks a ticket. Raffle the fucker then. Went down the pub Friday night to the handboat. Sold, sold about fucking... About 20 tickets. No, I sold about 100 tickets. Five bucks, 100 yeah, right? So we drew it out and the guy wasn't there, but he came and found out where I lived and he come around. Fuck me dead, the donkey didn't die that night, right? Terry. Yeah, fucking dead, yeah. Fucking dead, you know, the guy comes in. Hey, mate, come and have a look. Hey, got your donkey. Got him. He said, the fucking donkey's dead. I said, here's your fucking five bucks back. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. I think very old, but also very funny. I like Terry. Give it up for Terry Doyle.